Let's take a look at Panorama 5, the exciting 3D spatial positioning plugin from WaveArts. First, let's have a quick listen to just some of the 3D spatial positioning illusions it can create. Listen to the guitars in this example. I'm using parameter automation to create the illusion that they are circling the listener in opposite directions. It ships with several factory presets to get started, as well as an AB facility to instantly compare two different setups. Let's take a look at the user interface and the various controls. On the left is the view of the virtual space. Switch between top and 3D for two different views of the same area. The top overhead view has two different displays depending on the coordinate system chosen. In Cartesian mode, the dimensions are referred to as X, Y and Z, and measurements displayed in feet or meters depending on your preference. The display shows a rectangular representation of those. In polar view, the coordinates are displayed in degrees and the display is circular. In both views, the apparent sound source position is displayed as a blue sphere. This can be click dragged into position as required or will represent the current coordinates set by the controls. A pair of virtual speakers display how the listener would need to be orientated in relation to them to achieve the apparent position. These move around the virtual space as parameters dictate. Depending on the sound source mode chosen, either headphones are displayed on the virtual listener or a pair of speakers. They are shown in a brighter hue than the apparent source speakers and a position depending on the setting chosen. They do not move unless the settings change. The three control areas, direct, reflections and reverb, all feature parameters relating to those three audio sources that combine to create the illusion of sound source location. Direct relates to the direct shortest line from source to each ear. Three coordinates decide this apparent position in relation to the listener. The reference to those depends on mode. Azimuth relates to left or right. Elevation decides if the sound is above, below or level with the listener. And distance is how far away it is. Click on the Reflection tab to show more parameters for the initial first reflections. There are controls for the type of space. Each of the enclosing walls for the virtual room can have material type and distance specified. All of the usual reverb parameters are found on the Reverb tab and control those complex reflections created as time goes on and the sound waves disperse around the virtual space. And that's Panorama 5 from WaveArts, enabling you to create three-dimensional sound positioning anywhere.